All right, welcome back to you, Balanza Talks Entertainment. We get a cadet guest in the house. In my person, we're down there inside the music industry to make sure say yes, my presence and my name must be known in this industry. Jeremy, welcome. Daniel Miles inside the Good Morning Ninja says, good to have you. Thank you very much. Thank you. I'm glad to be here. All right. Now, I know say this particular video we will go see very soon. Now, your second musical video. Yes. Now, tell is. us how it be for you in the music industry, especially knowing, say, we get talented and um, different artists every day where they pump into this industry? Um, okay, for me, it's been grace, grace all the way. Like, uh, of course, there are a lot of people with different music, but the message matters. Mm. So my message has made my music different. Now, talking about the message. People, they question a lot of Nigerian artists. They think they, <laughs> some of their lyrical content, they're very, very poor. Mm. You believe so? And how you think they improve on your lyrics? Uh, okay, I believe, say, the, uh, some artists, uh, their lyrics is poor. And that is because of how they derive with their message. Okay. So, uh, for me, I... I can't say my lyrics is poor because it's eternal. So it's eternal and it's always um, it's always a message I pick from a message. So mm. I pick the message from a message so I just get to put, put everything together and end up with excellent reports. All right, now talking about your lyrics, where they eternal according to you. Maybe see your video and then we go judge whether really <laughs> you get content, good content for inside your musical video. Okay. All, All right. right, so let's watch it. Wow, I must say, I was thrilled. Like, watching this one, and I was like, I, I really? Trap music? Now, you go call yourself a gospel artist or a secular artist? 100% gospel artist, 100%. Mm. Yeah. Amazing. So, what do you inspire the song? Um, the, the spirituality of life. Okay. Yeah, because um, life, life here is physical to many, but actually it's more spiritual. Mm. We, uh, the, the, the mindset or uh, everyone out there having the thought that, okay, maybe they're going through a lot of challenges, like, okay, like the traffic I, I had to go through today to be here. So uh, it, some, to some mind, it, it can be like, it's just a normal thing, but it's not normal. These are things we control from the realm of the spirit. There's certainly something that would have caused such uh, matters to take place. So events in life physically are being governed by the realm of the spirit. And this can be because there are some minds who have choose to control things in their way, which can be negative and also can be positive. But it's all actually governed from the realm of the spirit. So, so what's the message there? Because talking about realm of the spirit, they fear yeah. people. Yeah, so because I think <laughs> traffic is the realm of the spirit. Yeah, so what's no, the message no. in the there? The message there is that life is 100% spiritual. You need to okay. be conscious of it. Be conscious of the fact that your life is divine. And what you have to achieve in life, you must function from the realm of the spirit. You must be attuned to the spirit of God mm. to, to get everything you want to achieve in life possible. As a gospel artist doing trap music in Nigeria, which will be the challenges that you they face? Uh, I don't they face any challenge because... Talk, talk uh, about the bill. I don't they face any challenge okay. because, uh, okay, like right now, I'm just coming from a tour. I, I'm doing music from Nigeria, but it's from Nigeria to the ends of the earth. Mm -hmm. So I'm not, my mind is not, my mind is too big to think of Nigeria. So Nigeria is just part of it, so I can't deny my country. So, and I will not because of the circumstances of the country to determine my kind of music. Mm. So I'm doing trap music because that is the level at which I want to pass my message. But it's for the whole world. And my first ever tour was in South Africa. And that was like in three month strikes and it was all awesome. Mm. Then I'm just coming from Ghana. So it's everywhere. So, now, when I watch this particular musical video, I see a lot of creativity where they put into it. Tell us mm. your creative process in making this, this particular video. kind of video. Okay, I, I wanted to, um, actually, it's a picture of Jesus and my man of God. So, like, I, I've seen my man of God displaying miracles and... You mean your pastor, my pastor and then yeah. Jesus? Okay. So, I've seen him uh, displaying in, uh, by performing miracles and all that. So... So I, in the same time, picturing Jesus, why he was still in the, uh, walking the earth here. 
So I, I thought of, okay, this music is life is spiritual. So how about I bring in the pictures? I wanted to do something, flashing things like show the street. I, this video was shot in South Africa. So I wanted to show flashing things and all that. But I was like, no, no, I think I shouldn't do that. Let me just do something different. Let me do something different. Let me do, uh, uh, let me bring in the Hebrew days. Let me bring in the Hebrew days. So that was the reason why for this. I had to bring, like, you have the, the three lepers. This okay. is Martha. And uh, you have the uh, young Lazarus, which means when Jesus asked Lazarus to rise. So I uttered the part like that, like, when, the late, uh, when Martha was crying, seeking for uh, help for uh, Lazarus to be back to life. So yes. I played that part of Jesus. Then the other part where I hid the lepers, of course, it was So you're just playing out the Bible story. Exactly. Mm. That was a picture behind it. Amazing, very, very nice. But doing a video like this, they cost to get now plenty of money you need to pump into it. Very, around. very expensive. Mm. Very, very expensive, actually. Right. Now, you talk to you, they actually travel go different countries for live performance. Tell us about that first time where you perform on stage and how you don't take handle stage um, fright. Mm. <laughs> okay. Uh, the first time ever, I, I, the first time was in church still, but it wasn't, I wasn't really born again at that time, but I was in church. So I was doing this kind of uh, love music and all that. So, but I was giving a platform to minister because it was a church program and it was a youth program. And they didn't mean to do something. So that was my first time. And of course it was uh, so much, so, so much to handle at the time. But with the ability of the Spirit of God, when I became born again, 100%, so with the ability of the Spirit of God, there's something that I, I can't think of because uh, he takes charge. So it's mm -hmm. not like I'm mine. Um, me displaying something is not him doing whatever he wants does to me. So I just come up the platform and he ministers to me. So definitely you get your inspiration from God. Of course, 100%. So what would be your message to everyone where they are, the way they actually watch you now? And seeing that you're doing so well in the gospel industry, where yeah. a lot of people they run from because they believe they come singing in this industry, not mm. the big money. So what would be your advice to people where want actually go the same path with you? I say love Jesus. Jesus is everything. Jesus is your grace. Jesus is your fame. I, I, know, I know no other person that is more famous than Jesus. So love Jesus and put your focus on Jesus. That is just 100%. Jesus is your fame. That is everything, everything. That is very good. So tell us yeah. about your social media handles. So people go follow you, uh, download your music. Okay. Uh, Danny Miles on Instagram, Danny Miles on uh, Twitter, Daniel Miles on Facebook, Daniel Miles on my YouTube. So go Is on my Is it Daniel YouTube. or Danny? Daniel. Daniel. D-A-N-I-E-L. -E -L. L. The Miles is M-Y-L-E-Z. Okay. So it's everywhere. Just type that everywhere. You get me. And then if you actually download them on every platform, even on, on every iTunes platform. too, you yes, can download Yes, it's on iTunes. Yeah. Thank you so much, Daniel Miles, for coming Thank to the you. studio. Thank and we you. wish you all the best. Hopefully, uh, we will see more of your musical video. Amen. To enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.